Good morning, my dear students. Welcome to the science class. Now we are dealing with chapter 12, which is about all about electricity. And in our last class, what we studied? We studied about potential difference, voltmeter, etc. Yes or no? I hope you are studying well the small topic which I am giving daily. So, today let us start with a problem. Okay. Uh, here is one question. I will read the question. How much work is done in moving charge of two clump across two points? having potential difference 12 volts. So, we want to find the work done, Joule. Okay, work done, Joule. So, the solution, solution, or the solution, and given that potential difference, PD, which is in volt, is equal to 12 volts. And what is given next? Net charge. Charge Q is also given. Is equal to 2 clump. So, we already studied that. What we studied? 1 volt is equal to 1 joule, which is work done by 1 C, which is the charge. Okay, so here um, potential difference and uh, charge is given, we want to find work done. So, we are taking a work done here, okay. J work done, J is equal to 1 volt into 1 coulomb. So, we will get uh, we will give the values for volt here. Okay. How many volts here? 12. Okay. And uh, how many column? 2. So, it is 12 into 2, 24. Okay. Then, the work done is 24 Joule. Understood? Once again, I will tell. We want to find out the work done. Okay, work done. We want to find out the work done. And uh, it is given that potential difference is 12 volts. Charge is 2 Coulomb. So, already we studied 1 volt is equal to 1 Joule by 1 Coulomb. Okay, uh, that is potential difference is equal to work done by charge. So, to find the work done, we multiplied volt and Coulomb. So, we got 24 Joule, which is the work done here. Okay. So, let us move to the next section, which is containing three questions. We want to answer for that. Okay. We want to answer for that. The first question I will read. Name a device that helps to maintain a potential difference across a conductor. Name a device to maintain a potential difference across a conductor. Okay. What will be that? A cell to maintain the potential difference a cell, a cell, a battery, a power supply, etc. If we added or if we are adding um, this cell, battery or power supply in a conductor, then the Potential difference will be changed. Then next question. What is meant by saying that the potential difference between two points is 1 volt? 
okay the potential difference between two points is 1 1 volt when one one joule work done is work is done to move one coulomb of charge from one place to another from one joule of work is done to move one one coulomb of charge from one place to another then he said that potential difference is 1 volt the potential difference between the two points is 1 volt okay once again when the one one when one joule work is done to move one column charge from one place to another then the potential difference between the two points is one one v okay one v or one volt then third question how much energy is given to each column of charge passing through a six volt battery how much energy is given to each column of charge passing through a six volt battery so here given that given that charge charge q is equal to how much 1c and potential difference v is equal to 6 volt okay what we want to do find out the energy given to each column of charge passing through a 6 volt battery find out the energy given to each column of charge passing through a 6 volt battery then potential difference we are writing potential difference potential difference v is equal to work done work done by work done by charge q okay work done by charge q here 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 v is equal to so we want to find work done okay work done is equal to v into c okay which is potential difference on charge so here v is equal to how much 6 and charge is equal, column is equal to um, column is equal to 1 okay so the work done is equal to work done is equal to 6 into 1 6 volt sorry um, 6 into work done is equal to 6 into 1 that is 6 joule Six joule. That means the energy given is six joule. Okay, the energy given for the energy given for um, the energy given to each column of charge passing through a six volt battery is six column. Sorry, six joule. Okay, the energy given for Each column of charge in a 6 volt battery is 6 joule. So, 
our next topic is circuit diagram circuit diagram so This is the negative terminal of the cell. This is the positive terminal of the cell. And this is plug key. Plug key. And this is ammeter positive side. And this one is negative side. This is the bulb. Okay. These are the components. Okay. These are the components of a schematic drawing. These are the components of a schematic drawing. Okay. Let us write here. That is a cell. A cell which is a which gives the energy uh, power or energy and uh, a bulb which is an electronic electronic component and switch key or plug key plug key then what this is what these are the connecting wires through this the current i flows okay connecting wires then ammeter for checking the current flow okay it is connected in series so any other any other components which which is used in um, circuit do you know do you know any other components okay let us see if there is any other components which is used in a circuit okay there are some more components like resistance then um, wire joint etc okay uh, and we are going to like resistance and all there, there are some other more components well, let us see the symbols how we will write the symbols of those okay i will draw in the board i will write the component first and on one side i'll on the left hand side i'll write the components and right hand side i'll draw the symbol okay let us see an electric cell first one first component An electric cell. One is an electric cell. How it is? And a negative and positive. Okay, this that's all. Then then what? A battery or a combination of cells. A battery or a combination of of cells how we will draw that positive The negative is drawn here okay like this is a battery or a combination of cells then plug key or switch okay switch which is open open switch open switch how we are drawing that this is open switch okay open switch and close the switch close the switch close the switch is drawn like this okay close the switch so the next uh, 
how to draw a wire joint wire joint wire joint fifth one a wire joint this one is a wire joint okay this one is a wire joint then wire crossing wire wire crossing okay without joining without joining wire crossing wire crossing we will draw like this this is the wire crossing then electric bulb we know that electric bulb how we will draw like this okay electric bulb then resistance i said the uh, the button resistance how we will draw okay this is a resistance or resistor then variable resistance variable resistance variable resistance same like this drawing after that one arrow okay or one more is there one more is there we can draw same drawing like this sorry same drawing like this and like a symbol okay this like one symbol what is that variable resistance okay then ammeter you are knowing ammeter and volt meter finally we are going to ammeter ammeter and volt meter okay how to draw uh, how to give the symbol of ammeter ammeter this is ammeter okay positive and minus side then finally we go to volt meter how it is drawn v okay this 10 are the commonly used to com commonly used components in a circuit okay this turn which are the a cell uh, or a bat uh, a cell is the first one second one a battery uh, or a combination of cells then uh, switch open or uh, switch closed then fifth one wire join and wire, wire overlap over coming okay or uh, overlapping then electric bulb resistance or resistor okay then variable resistance that is having q type of symbol one is like this and another is like this okay two symbols are there then ammeter this is ammeter symbol and this is voltmeter symbol okay and this is the voltmeter symbol and today for today's class this much is enough and we will meet with more in our next class okay thank you and remember one thing little by little you have to study for you only we your teachers or your management are 
arranging the video or the alternative way. Use this time, study little by little, achieve the success. Thank you.